Hello friends, we are going to perform the practical op-amp error integrator and a differentiator aim to study the integrator and differentiator using op-amp and observe its input and output waveforms. This is the circuit for op-amp as an integrator. IC741 is used as here op-amp. The input is applied to inverting terminal through the register R1. The feedback capacitor is connected between the inverting input and output. The non-inverting terminal is grounded. The plus VCC that is plus 9 volt is connected at pin number 7 and minus VEE that is minus 9 volt is connected to pin number 4. The output is connected to pin number 6. So we applied the sine wave at the input and observe the output. We build this circuit in protest simulation software. We pick the parts from here, we search through the keyword 741 that is op-amp, the component list shows here, we need register, capacitor, <laughs> okay, now we place all the components. IC741 and register and capacitor. We need <coughs> the AC source. We can get it from the generator mode sign and we need an oscilloscope to show the input and output waveforms. <coughs> we need plus VCC and minus VEE supply. And ground. We flip this. Ok, now we connect all the components. We set the minus VEE to minus 9 volt plus VCC to 9 volt value of the capacitor to 0 0.1 microfarad. <coughs> we apply the sine wave input with the amplitude 5 volt and a frequency of 100 hertz. Okay. We connect the oscillate scope to input and output. So A is connected to input and B of the oscilloscope is connected to output. Now we start the simulation. We get the two waveforms here. So, the input waveform is shown by the yellow color waveform and output is shown by the blue color waveform. So, 
the input is sine wave as it start from 0, the output is start from positive peak. So, it is a cos wave. So, sinusoidal wave, we apply the sine wave and its output is a cos wave form. So, the output, so the input is integrated and come across the output. Therefore, this circuit can be used as an integrator. Similarly, we can apply a square wave at the input and we get the triangular wave. Let's test this waveform. We change the sign to pulse. Pulse voltage to 5 volt and a frequency of 100 hertz. Okay. Start. So, this is the input and this waveform is output. So, square wave is converted into triangular wave. So, op amp can be used as an integrator. Similarly, we will see the op amp differentiator. In differentiator circuit, the resistor and capacitors are interchanged. That is, the capacitor in integrator is interchanged, replaced by the resistor, and resistor is replaced by the capacitor. So, we will connect this circuit. We apply the sine wave. Amplitude 5, frequency is 100. Okay. Run the simulation. So, input, input waveform is sine wave, then output is minus cos wave. So, it is a negative or inverted cosine wave is there present at the output. So, sine is converted into minus cos. So, this circuit can be used as a differentiator. So, we conclude that op amp IC741 can be used as an integrator and differentiator. Thank you.